This could be part of the biggest discovery in human history. A rocket carrying NASA's Perseverance Mars rover took off from Cape Canaveral on July 30th. The rover's mission, to find signs of life on another planet. It'll take seven months to get to Mars. Once it's there, Perseverance will be dropping a helicopter called Ingenuity, which will collect aerial views of Mars. And this is going to be, of course, our first ever demonstration of powered flight on another planet. The rover itself will be drilling for samples in an area called Jessero. It's known to have had water once. And where there's water, there may be, or may have been, life. Possibly billions of years ago. There are environments that have been found, especially by the Curiosity rover, uh, that by every uh, uh, characteristic that we know of look habitable. This NASA scientist mused about finding extraterrestrial life at a recent press conference. For me, the life question is really quite uh, foundational. I'm really interested in what the administrator says to this, right? You know, for me, it's kind of as a scientist, it's really the holy grail. It's like, you know, when you go from N equals one, there's only one life we've ever observed, to N equals many, multiple lives, everything changes. Like there's, I mean, you can do research, you can ask questions, you have no clue how to even start, right? It's, it's like opening up a whole new building of exploration in a way you never could. I think there would be no bigger discovery in the history of humanity than finding life that is not on our own world. And I think it'll fundamentally transform how we do exploration in the future. The NASA launch is the third mission to Mars in recent weeks. A week earlier, China sent an unmanned probe on its way to the Red Planet. Called Questions to Heaven, it arrived there in February 2021. And on July 20th, United Arab Emirates launched the Hope Probe from a Japanese space center. The Hope Probe will be studying Martian atmosphere. And all these missions will teach us things, and they'll also get us one step closer to a human trip to Mars. It's just a pity that David Bowie isn't here to see it. This is Inside Edition Digital.